So the last part is the like uh, salt. What is a salt? It's nothing but a compound that is formed by complete or partial re replacement of the ionizable hydrogen atom of an acid by the metal or an ammonium ion. So uh, you know guys like in uh, case of uh, acid like H plus ion. So the a particular metal or ammonium ion replace the will replace uh, the hydrogen of uh, acid and it will form a compound that is known as salt. So what are the types of salt? Like normal salt which are formed by complete complete uh, replacement in a seal. So like for example HCl plus NaOH, NaCl plus uh, H2O. And in case of acidic NaHSO4. So like one hydrogen atom is still yet to be replaced. So partial is called acidic. Basic is like when it formed by uh, like hydroxyl. Like in case of base basic uh, salt is like hydroxyl partial replacement of hydroxyl ions. So for example like uh, PbOH whole two. This is a base plus HCl. Uh, like partial you can say PbOH Cl plus H2. This is in case of basic. Mixed mixed salt mixed is like uh, it has two uh, various kinds of like uh, like this Na KCO3 Ca like OCl Cl. In case of double salt double salt two I like Na like K2SO4 Al2SO4 all three dot two 24H2. This is kind of a double salt, like two, uh, like different K2SO4 and Al2SO4, aluminium and potassium sulfate are there. In case of complex salt, complex is like that can dissociate any time. I will give you one example. You can remember this as only for uh, your exam as of now. So naming of salt, like the first word come from the metal of the base. The base that is being used, the metal, like uh, the sodium hydroxide, sodium chloride, so sodium, and uh, like the last part come from the anion of the acid. So combination of cation from a base, cation means a positive ion, and anion from an acid that is a negative part. So this is mainly uh, the different types of salt. Like uh, now uh, properties, they are crystalline solid, they conduct electricity, clear and transparent, mostly a soluble in water. One important part I have written it over here like hydrolysis. When salt is applied in like water, what will happen? So if I write a uh, salt over here, I will take an example of Na2CO3 plus water. It will produce you, it will give you H2CO3 and 2NaOH. So this is an example of hydrolysis. Like a salt is reacting with water and it's forming an acid and a base. So this is a weak acid and this is a strong base. Remember this kind of example, guys. Uh, in case of like, I will give you another example, NH4Cl plus H2 will give you NH4OH plus HCl. So in this case, uh, this is weak base and strong acid, the, the, just the reverse one. And I will give you another last example, CH3COONH4, this is uh, 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 like salt, h 2 will give you CH3COOH, citric acid, uh, uh, sorry acetic acid and NH4OH. So both these two are weak. So you guys can write down this uh, like examples of uh, reactions and uh, like some other like preparations as well. I will tell you how to prepare like soluble and insoluble salts. The same thing like direct compos uh, composition in case of soluble salt like sodium and chlorine you can get like sodium chloride, zinc and uh, hydrochloric acid you can get zinc sulfate and hydrogen, uh, like zinc and NaOH will give you sodium zincate and hydrogen. So various kinds of this are there like an act, again act with uh, like uh, acetic oxide like for forming SO2 like SO2 or CO2 these are the acetic oxide and basic oxides. So acetic oxide and basic oxides will produce a salt. That will be always a soluble. I will give you one example like SO2 plus NO2O. So this is acetic oxide, this is basic oxide, and it will give you NO2SO3. That is soluble in water. 
I'm, I'm trying to give you guys as much as examples as possible, as much as I can write over here the number of equations. In case of insoluble salts as well, the same thing, direct, uh, like for direct uh, combination, combination of an acetic acid with basic oxides by precipitation and all, etc. Et now, uh, uh, like guys, uh, one more thing, like uh, preparation of, if you have to prepare, uh, like I, I will give you just one, another one, last example, like preparation of insoluble salt from another insoluble salt. So PBO plus HNO3 will give you PBNO3 O2 plus H2. So this is also insoluble, this is also insoluble. Okay? So from insoluble PBO, if we are forming from a, a, like an insoluble salt from an insoluble, uh, another insoluble compound. And now some another like iron chloride, copper, uh, like blue vitriol, copper sulfate, and lead chloride, etc. Calcium carbonate, CaCO3. This guy is the how to prepare and synthesis. This is basically a pure theoretical part. Nothing is there for me to tell you guys. You can follow any, any, any uh, textbook you want in order to go through the chapter. So this is the basic part of acid bases and salt that you guys need for uh, like class 8, 9, 10, uh, like in three classes as well. And like so write the equations, remember the equations. If you have any problem, do write it in the comment section. And uh, uh, till then, keep on studying, keep on uh, relating. And uh, till then guys, uh, see you, keep on studying. Thank you.